I don't have a smartphone. I wish I did because if I had a smartphone it would, uh, as we say, blow your mind to see how strong it is. Uh, this is just a regular kind of an inexpensive phone. I'm going to dial my number here. That should pretty much speak for itself. Literally it pushes the meter to its capacity over 6 volts per meter peak well as high as a hundred thousand microwatts per square meter now remember biological effects start down here at 3.4 microwatts per square meter and my cell phone is still connected and look at that pushing the meter to its capacity and people are holding these next to their heads all over the world now watch what happens when I disconnect the call See that? The meter shuts off immediately. Phone turns on. Meter's measuring past its capacity at 6 volts per meter, which is over 95,000 microwatts per square meter. And I unplug it. And there you have it. Is this brilliant setup here look like anything that's familiar to any of you this is what this cordless phone is giving off in terms of radio frequency exposure right inside the bedroom here so here would be the exposure levels sleeping right on the bed almost topping out the meter at 6 volts per meter ninety-five thousand microwatts per square meter and remember bioinitiative report precautionary levels are three to six microwatts per square meter three to six that's all the way down at the bottom of this scale uh, what's the fix what's the suggestion it's right next to it. Get a landline and plug it in. I unplug this cordless phone and I return it to my friend who I borrowed it from. I don't have a cordless phone in my house. I'm going to enable the wireless. I'm going to save it. And look at that. Even though I have an Ethernet cable plugged into it, Ethernet cord, the radio frequency meter is showing extremely dangerous levels of RF radiation coming out of the modem. I'm going to turn the wireless mouse on. All right, and check out the radio frequency meter picking up on the Bluetooth. from the mouse. Check this out. Let's turn on this keyboard. Alright, and, and this is simply the keyboard communicating now here's a tablet like most people use and let's turn the Wi-Fi on so now the tablet is seeking to establish connection with a wireless network it's topping the meter out in terms of peak signal strength and it's going up pretty high in terms of average power density now let's turn the Bluetooth on interesting
Let me turn the Wi-Fi off. And this is just the Bluetooth. <laughs> 